is exactly the question. When will it calm down? I mean, we've got a staggering amount of damage out there from all of the ice, and now you're talking about perhaps more ice? Yeah, maybe more ice, yeah, on top of everything that we've already seen out there. It's been very tough this weekend, I know that, especially south of Portland where we've had all that ice accumulation. Now, we may start seeing some of that ice and freezing rain through Portland still tonight up through the West Hills and into areas of the Gorge. For your Sunday night, I still believe that the roads may turn icy. So the roads that maybe had small improvements, I mean, just like teeny tiny improvements from today, those may actually start to ice on over once again. So freezing rain is moving into areas of the metro, um, and it will be surrounding a lot of locations around Portland as well. And I think the worst of it, though, is going to be heading into areas of the gorge. Temperatures are really fighting. They're trying to get warmer. I mean, to the south of us, down to Balmerin County, and down to Eugene, it is much warmer, but around Portland, we're still doing uh, temperatures right around freezing as we did see earlier. All right, ice storm warning, that's until 6 a.m. Yeah, you see this whole section right here. I think, again, the West Hills kind of extending up to, uh, to the northwest there. And out towards the gorge, uh, 205 to the east are going to be the most vulnerable spots. But we may even see some very uh, light accumulations here in Portland, extending out to the south and to the west, and maybe even across the way into areas of Washington. Into the gorge is a winter storm warning till 6 a.m. I know that uh, I-84 is having uh, a little bit of movement now, but heading into tonight, there still could be that freezing rain and some very icy conditions. So if you are thinking about doing some traveling on I-84, uh, be prepared for more winter weather. There's all the moisture. It's on the way. We haven't quite seen enough here in Portland. Anything that's falling down right now is going to be very, very light. Uh, but I do anticipate it to, uh, you know, strengthen and become a little more deep as far as that moisture goes around here as we go into the evening hours. You can see how light it is right here, and then that goes down to the south. So very light rain down towards Woodburn, and if we're seeing that freezing rain right now, um, it's going to be pretty light, but still enough to start that glaze, uh, to start making things very icy out there on all the major roads. And so you can see Portland right there extending into Gresham, where it's 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 just not very heavy yet, but again, any little bit's going to cause some issues down towards Salem and uh, over towards to the east there. If you're heading towards uh, you know Mill City and out towards the west there, uh, towards Sheridan, very light rainfall right now. All right, ice accumulation. Let's take a look at that real quick. Uh, this is uh, showing Portland all the way to the east here. Why? Mainly because these are going to be the locations that we're going to be most concerned about. Down to the south, really not as much. So you can see Portland through Trout Hill to about 11 p.m. tonight. We may have that thin layer of ice, and then it does extend to the northwest there. The worst of it, though, is probably still going to be in areas of the gorge and across the way into Washington. Uh, and then it really strengthens as we go into Monday morning. That's why the winter storm warnings till tomorrow morning, because we're going to see a bulk of that ice even through the morning hours may extend into part of the afternoon. We can't rule that out as well. 31 degrees right now in Portland. We do have that uh, wintry mix, but I was going to say more so of that freezing rain. The wind running out of the east southeast till at 18 miles per hour. This is some ice that was uh, building up on some of the trees over in Sandy, Oregon. See that here. So we already know that everything's you kind of teetering right now. We've already have power outages. We have some trees that may be really close and this ice tonight may put it over and we'll have to uh, keep you updated. Here's Sunday night here at 1030, mainly rain, but see that little pocket right there? That's Portland and uh, that's going to be that shot for that freezing rain tonight. All right, seven day forecast. I have 39 tomorrow. We're going to try to warm up down to the south. Eugene, fine, 50 degrees probably. Salem in the 40s, mid 40s probably, but Portland, we're going to be probably the upper 30s tomorrow. Uh, we do have a dry day, Wayne. I think it's going to be on Wednesday. We'll work on thawing things out uh, as we go through the course of probably Tuesday, Wednesday, and through the week. I think we're all just focusing on get, getting through this one more night. Get through tonight, <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, Joseph. Next, the weather.